blush, a touch of life. Hello, this is Vicky. Let's talk about the beauty of blush. It's like a magic wand that instantly brightens your face. It brings life to your face, making you look more vibrant and youthful. A little color on your cheeks makes you look healthy and radiant. It can transform a dull complexion into a glowing one. It's like a little secret to looking fresh and awake. Just a few strokes can make a big difference. Without blush, your makeup can look flat and lifeless. It lacks that pop of color that brings everything together. Blush adds dimension and shape to your face, enhancing your natural beauty. It highlights your cheekbones and defines your features, giving you a more sculpted and polished look. Section two, finding your perfect shade. Choosing the right blush is important. It can enhance your natural beauty and give you a healthy radiant glow. The right shade will flatter your skin tone, making your complexion look more vibrant and alive. It should look natural, not overdone. The goal is to achieve a subtle flush that mimics a natural blush. For fair skin, try light pinks or peaches. These shades add a gentle touch of color without overwhelming your complexion. Medium skin tones look great with rosy pinks or corals. These colors enhance the warmth in your skin and provide a beautiful natural finish. For darker skin tones, go for rich berries or warm browns. These deeper shades complement your skin's richness and add a stunning pop of color. Section three, tools of the trade. You don't need a lot of tools to apply blush. Just a few key items can make a big difference. A good brush is essential. It helps in blending the blush seamlessly onto your skin. A fluffy brush with soft bristles is best. It ensures a smooth and even application. You can use a natural or synthetic brush. Each has its own benefits and can affect the finish. Make sure it's the right size for your cheeks. The right size helps in covering the area evenly. A smaller brush gives more precise application. It's perfect for detailed work and contouring. Section four, mastering the application. First, find the apples of your cheeks. Smile, see those round parts? That's where you apply blush. Apply blush lightly and blend upwards. Follow the natural curve of your cheekbones. Don't go too close to your nose or too far down your face. Section five, the art of blending. Blending is key for a natural look. You don't want any harsh lines. Use circular motions to blend the edges of the blush. Blend upwards towards your temples. This will lift your face and give you a youthful glow. Section six, building up the color. It's better to start with less blush and build up gradually. You can always add more. It's harder to remove excess blush. Tap off any excess product from your brush. Apply a light layer first, then add more if needed. Section seven, setting your masterpiece. To make your blush last longer, set it with powder. Use a translucent powder or a powder that matches your skin tone. Apply the powder lightly over your blush. This will prevent your blush from fading or smudging. Section eight, the lighting test. Always check your makeup in different lighting. Natural light is best Go outside or look in a mirror near a window. Make sure your blush looks natural and even. Adjust it if needed. Section nine, the final touch. 
blush completes your makeup look. It adds warmth, dimension and a healthy glow. With the right technique, you can achieve a flawless finish. Experiment with different shades and techniques. Find what works best for you. Have fun with it. If you like the video, please like and subscribe for the latest fashion and beauty tips. Thank you for your support.